Hi guys, I just wanted to jump here real quick because I received something that I want to open with you. It's a baby carrier and I'm gonna need that. We are traveling to Cyprus in August so I'm gonna need that to carry her with me to the airport. I thought it would be much easier rather than having a push chair and all that. I received this today and I want to open and see and try it the good thing about that you can carry um, your baby for children aged three months upwards until they are 20 kilos which i don't know what age is that but i guess it's two years old is it 20 kilos i'm not, I'm not sure to be honest i don't even know her weight at the moment you know i'm just guessing but Obviously, she's more than three months. So I'm opening this thing. That's a manual as well. So I've ordered it from this website that I've ordered hair push chair and all that, which is called Online for Babies. So you can find a lot of things that are, you know, good deals, sales, and all that. Yeah, it's called Nino Baby Carrier. This is crying all the time and you know i usually put her in the sling i know you know when she's getting tired that's when she starts crying and she wants attention and um comfort so i usually put her in the sling but when you have the baby at the front it's a bit you're a bit restricted you can't do too many things and um Having her at the back, I think it's much easier to, you know, maneuver around and get things done. Like for example, doing the dishes. I can't do the dishes while um, she's at the front, you know. Or it's a bit, I feel like it's a bit dangerous as well because, you know, maybe I will open the cupboard and if she's at the front, she might hit, you know, her head or whatever. So I think it's much safer especially now that she's grown and I don't she can turn her head she can do all that she's more you know strong and stable so I thought I should get a baby carrier and um, that will allow me to put her at the back as well it's usually for outdoors but no one is saying that you can use it inside so so yeah that's the baby carrier and let's try it on so that's how it looks like so let me try the simple thing and put her at the front first and then and then let's try at the back so I secured it at the back and then I just pull the straps okay and then I guess the front is much much easier to put it on and then you just adjust through here once your baby once you put the baby in and then you close it up there from here and then close it like this and there you have it so now let me try to actually put iris on me so her, her legs come up on the side like this and then this correct and then you clip it clip the back and you pull the strap I need to adjust it here as well so it can be nice and tight nice and tight here as well there you have it 
She loves it. She loves it. And I got in grey colour because um, you don't know. You might, I might have more babies in the future and there might be boys and um, I won't have to buy another one. Yeah, so after like a thousand years, I managed to put it on my bag. I don't recommend doing that by yourself if you don't know what you're doing. I recommend someone being there to put the baby at your back, you know, while doing that. Because I have to put her and then, have, you know, bring the straps in front and secure it. So it's a bit difficult. But yeah, there she is. so you you make sure their hands is under that strap because otherwise they're gonna be hanging out too much it's not really safe but apart from that she looks good she looks secure and she looks happy <laughs> oh easy baby oh yeah she's trying to take it hand out but I stay there you know I know baby I know that's it you know that's it now my final comments is that yeah it's very easy to put it at the front it's very easy and um all that but putting hair at the back that's the tricky part and you need to have someone with you to put hair at the back for you and also here I think it's secure and everything is nothing like it feels secure and all that but here it's just I feel like maybe this one I could just say higher actually because that's where I feel like you know this one will come out will fall down but I can actually adjust that bring it a bit up here and here so really you can bring it where you want it yeah that feels a bit better for me so everyone is different for me it feels more secure if it's, well not too high though because yeah so there that's fine she's okay she has room to maneuver around she's secure that was the nino baby carrier unboxing and try on i don't know how a baby kaya carrier should feel you know on on me it could feel more comfortable maybe if that was like softer or a bit bigger or maybe if i have another strap here it would be a bit better more comfortable but i will rate it seven out of ten because it does the job so yeah actually i'm gonna go for a walk with her and see how it goes and um, and i can let you know we just came back from my walk and we walked for about 20 minutes and it was actually quite comfortable and um, I've discovered that at the front it has like a let me show you it has like a pocket it's, it's nothing major or anything like that but it's quite convenient because I put just you know you can put your card or your car keys just in there that was my spontaneous little um unboxing and try on of nina baby carrier first impressions are good so hopefully i will have the same opinion at the end after using it like a hundred times thanks guys for watching this video and i'll see you in the next one very very
very very soon bye for now don't forget to like and subscribe yes 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 all night long yeah we dance with our raising tongues and all day long